And um, I have a, a YouTube uh, channel, a Therapy for the Heart. And I'd like to find out what you're doing here and what the green square means and the uh, red square. So, if you can, what can I have your names? Uh, my name is Miriam. Uh, my name is Alex. Uh, my name is Colin. Hi, it's nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. So, could you tell me a little bit about what this all means to you? Okay, the whole situation started when the government wanted to um, be like. Um, the, to go to school, it has to be more expensive to pay for the... Because the teachers in our CJFs, they are not really good, you know, they're not really, really good teachers. So the government wants to make it like the more expensive, the cost for school to make, to have better teacher. But some doesn't have the money to pay more. So the red square is against it. We, they don't want to pay more. The green square is, we think it's a great idea to or pay more. Or we don't care to pay more. Like, like the green square, square is like, we are, we are for like the idea of like paying more for her school to have better teacher, to have a better education. But you know, uh, the red square. But uh, we, we think that uh, school need to be free for everyone, like uh, some country in Europe. So the red square want to have free school, so like for university, CGF and. But the red, uh, the green square just want, want to pay because we want we want good education, a good teacher. Because seriously, the teacher in CGM not really good. Do you do you feel that the teacher, the level of the teaching, uh, is not very good? Uh, well, I think it's very good. Like, it's like in the United States. Uh, it's Comparable. Comparable. And, uh, but it's different opinion because, yes. Yeah, it's, uh, uh, it's depend um, uh, our vision of the, of the, of the, of the, of the education. What? Left. It's like um, the, the left side and the right side. Opposite. Totally opposite. Yeah. So, but for for now in uh, Montreal, the red square do um, manifestation, but too much manifestation. They, all of this thing get out of control. They are people beating in the street. They are people bleeding. Who's beating who? Uh, um, some of the police officer beating person who didn't do anything. They're just walking on the street and police officers are like, okay, they're red square, let's beat them up. St red square beat green square. We didn't, green square. We, didn't uh, we don't really heard about the green square beating red square, but like all of the violence come from the web, red square. They are in the street making noise all night. But yeah. it's because they have a... Uh, uh, 78 uh, law, yeah. law and uh, this is not uh, it's against the Charte de droit de la liberté freedom freedom to talk freedom yes. to gather yeah. but uh, the um, special they put law. a special law to um, Well, you can't strike. They're against manifestation. They don't want people. If you do a manifestation and you don't uh, you give, the you give to the police uh, the plan of the manifestation, uh -huh. they will let you do it. Yeah, illegal. They, it's well, illegal. They don't let you do it. You have to, what they call here like, like a permit. Yeah. Okay. Permission. You have yeah. to have yes. permission to demonstrate. Is that but we have they can cho choice uh, who. Uh, the, uh, where's the Where's the Where are we? Where are we? And then when and all this, uh, with this and all. But right now, uh, with the manifestation, we have uh, really so much problem with the police. Because yes, it, yeah, but they, um, they hit, they are violent. Yeah, they, they hit everybody. If you're just a, 
um, the people, the normal people walking in the street and you don't care about the manifestation, they will hit you because you're there in the street. So, did, right. did, did one of you say that before that the people that are manifesting and have the red squares, are they being violent or are they just they're demonstrating but not being violent? They were demonstrating violence by yelling insult. They were yelling at police officers. They were yelling but it's bad not, words. Seriously, it, so they were not, not really demonstrated violence. It was just Please. like verbal. But when the government government really like didn't want to uh they want to like okay we stop all this you win red square the red square began to be violent really violent you mean violent not in behavior but in words uh no behavior what do they do beat? uh they beat people i saw a video or i don't know it was a picture or something uh beating someone with a baseball bat i'm not even kidding I don't you think know. that's a usual occurrence with the red squares, or is it uh, that's but very unusual? Some, some are okay. They only manifest, you know. They yell all of this, you know, blah blah blah. But in the manifestation of red square, there are some people. Not every red square, but some people are just there. They're too much to um, put to put violence dance. and to. F they are only there to cause trouble. Yeah. They are only yes. there to. Like black, Demonstrate uh, violence. black. Group, uh, they have the black with the black uh, flag. Why is it? But you know the the group anonymous. Anonymous, anonymous. you know it. Oh, yeah, but yeah. Um, they they um, they hear anonymous. about the manifestation in Montreal and they um, uh, they wear they they. Go on, they go on the streets wearing a uh, vendetta mask. You know the movie uh, with Natalie Portman? They're wearing their mask and they are, I think, the most violent. Seriously, but they are the reason that there is much violence with Red Square. So it's a small group of which. Red uh, but Anonymous uh, are an internet. They uh, take the position of the website of the govern government. Government. Uh -huh. um, of uh, Quebec. And the Grand Prix uh, are in the, the Grand Prix de Montreal. Are you all from Quebec? Um, yeah. From Montreal, yeah. Montreal. From Montreal. Yeah. From Montreal though, not not uh, Quebec. The province of Quebec, but the... In the city of Montreal. Yeah. Yes. Uh -huh. So how long are you here for? Uh, here in New York? Uh -huh. uh, it's the first, first day. The first day here. Well, welcome to New York. <laughs> Thank you. That's very nice. And um, I had a question about the... Uh, they raised the tuition, but it seemed to me it was a very large increase in tuition, not a, a gradual increase. Is that true? Um, they take so long to decide what to do with all of this that we are paying the price. We were supposed uh. to start at CJEP in August, and we are going to start CJEP in October. Oh, so your school is being delayed then? Yeah. yeah. Because and, uh, so we will lose um, our, um, our Christmas, okay. vac Christmas vacation. We're supposed to have two months of vacation, yeah. but we lost, lost and it. Huh. Seriously, I don't think that all of this is done. Seriously, I'm sure that when we start school, there will still be students blocking the entry of the CJEP, you know, making noise, like putting damage on monuments, you know, they. So it's, I'm, it's, I'm it sure. makes, makes it hard for a lot of people then on, on both sides. For all people who want to go to school. Or go to school. Yeah. But right. the Red Square wants school. Mm -hmm. uh, green. What university? You're going to um, high school, college? High school. High school. High school. Last year of high school. school. Next year is CJEP. Next year From CJEP. It's a... CJEP, is that? CJEP. It's a... It's like, it's, it's, it's like two or three years between the high school and the university. Oh, I see. Because uh -huh. our, our high school is just five years. Uh -huh. so and the university is four years? Four years. But it depends what Where? you choose. Back. Oh, and again. Sorry. So, <laughs> uh, I'm still, I'm still, I'm scared that it's all going to start over when I'm going to go to school, you know, being at home for I don't know, two or three months, it's not good. I want to go to school, I want to have a diploma, I want to have a job, sure. not be at home doing nothing. You know, I'm supposed to finish all the, my educate, my, my 
education in seven years, but with all of that, I don't know where I'm gonna finish finish, finish it. Yeah. So it's, I'm so very, it's very, to you. Uh, yeah, very confusing and hard to set your future yeah. uh, in your mind about what's going to happen with all yeah. this. Yeah. Yeah. How do you like New York so far? I really like that. Awesome. It's, it's a little bit like Montreal. Yeah. Seriously, I walk in the street. I, Sometimes I forget what? that but I'm in New York. I think, oh, I'm Montreal, in Montreal, right? but no. It's bigger than Montreal. Yeah. That's yeah. for sure. Yeah. It's like yeah. bigger than Montreal. But Montreal yes. is like the village. Here, this is like the village. It's more like the village than the rest of Montreal. Uh, There's cobblestone stone streets and yeah, there's yeah. A, like a whole part of Montreal that's like the village. Old like, Montreal. Ma yeah. Like with the uh, monuments, all like history and all of this. But there's uh, like a new part with building and uh -huh. all of this. It's very like modern, a like New like York. That. Like New York. I yeah. used to walk around in Montreal, and I, um, in, when I was much younger. And I uh, would carry a wine skin with me, and I would share the wine skin, you know, with the people of Montreal, and that was a lot of fun. Yeah, it's really nice for shopping, but I, I prefer to shopping here. <laughs> More uh, shop. For me, it's the capital of fashion. <laughs> yeah. Fifth Avenue for life. Fifth Forever. Avenue for life. <laughs> Yes. Broadway too. Broadway and all of this. We, we like are, Broadway. We hope to meet like celebrities. Yeah. Ah. Cross finger. Well, you may very well here. I mean, there are a lot of places you could just run into them just by accident. Yeah. Have yeah. you been to uh, Soho? No. Uh, no. No. We hope. I really want to go like this. This is like Bronx and all of this. Uh -huh. and all the part of New York and all the Bronx, Harlem, but we are there. This is not on our map. And so Maybe you. Maybe I will come. Here. Live here. I want to go. I want to really here. want to. I have like a townhouse, maybe, maybe make near the John Lennon townhouse, and make movies. And make movies. Yeah. When I was 12 years old, I ran away to get to New York City from Albany, New York, well, on my bicycle. 12 years old. I didn't get that far. I got maybe 30 miles outside of Albany, New York, which is the capital of New York State. Uh, but I finally made it here later on. So I'm I, 16, but I live with my mom in Montreal. <laughs> yeah, we all hope to. Well, we all hope one day to go to New York and live like the, the American dream. You know, we have all we want. Uh, yeah. So, and you have how many? I'm sorry, how many more days now? Uh, uh, three days left. Oh, three yes. days. Ah. Yeah. Monday is the last day. Yeah. Like, and back to the school. Back to Doing our exam, our test. Yeah. Uh, oh yeah. Uh, it's yeah. hard to it's hard to leave here. Oh yeah, it's gonna be hard. Yeah. Right. Yeah. I love here. I want to stay here. I want to stay here forever. <laughs> oh yeah. Uh, well, thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you very much. Again, I'm gonna just ask your name one more time. I'm gonna put it on the on the video, so it's. Uh, my name is Jean Pierre Bernard. Okay. Uh, my phone number is six seven seven four seven three 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 and your last name? Uh, Campo Bertrand. <laughs> Mine is easier. What's yours? Alex, A L E X E, Fortier. F O R T I E R. Oh, thank you. And, you're and my name is Miriam. Miriam. Uh, it's easy to spell Miriam. Yes, right. I can smell that one. Yeah. Uh, Chagnon. C H A G N O N. Ah, okay. And spell your last name for me again. Just okay. Very slowly. Uh, C A M P E A U B. Uh, 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 between two words, uh, a little bar. Like. Uh huh. Uh, B E R T R A N D. Okay. Well, thank you so much. Campo Bertrand. Uh, Campo and Bertrand. Two worlds. <laughs> Two words. Uh, words. Uh, words. <laughs> Two words. Right. Okay. Well, I'm going to sign off. This is Mark Sell. And thank you so much for um, taking the time to uh, talk to me. Uh, what is your channel on YouTube? Do you uh, I'm going to give you that right now.